What's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video and welcome to another summer 2021 test realm update video as well. <laughs> if you do not already know, I'm doing a full game balance walkthrough on my channel and I could not have timed this any more perfectly because in the new summer 2021 test realm, Firecat Alley is completely different and that is our next main quest that we are going to be doing on Isabella Blade here. So not only are we going to be checking out the new Firecat Alley, but we are also going to be questing my balance wizard. So it's really a win-win in my opinion. So if you guys are excited to see the new Firecat Alley and to see Isabella quest her way through Wizard City, please make sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button as it goes a really long way and shows me that you guys are enjoying this walkthrough. And if you do not already know, I do have a Discord server. It is linked down below, so go check that out as well. We are so close to 100 members, so I would go ahead and join because we're probably going to be doing a giveaway once we hit that goal. And if nothing else, I just want to be able to hang out with you guys while I'm not playing Wiz. But with all that being said, let's hop right on into Firecat Alley. Alrighty guys, are we excited? I had to double check to make sure that we were in test realm. Imagine how embarrassing it would be if I just wasn't. All right, putting out you say fires. this was orchestrated by the former death professor? I thought he was dead. Well, all the other dead are back, so yeah, that makes sense. The whole city's a mess. The guard is completely overwhelmed. I hate to ask, but could you see if Private Quinn on Firecat Alley needs help? I guess so. We'll go see if he needs assistance. It's not like you're the grown-up here or anything. I love this game. The storyline in this game is just so funny to me. Having kids do your dirty work? Sounds illegal. All right, here is the new Firecat Alley. Dude, I'm excited. I haven't even seen anything yet. And... <laughs> Damn, guys, that took a hot minute to load, but we're here oh, now. Oh, you're that Unicorn Way hero wizard, aren't you? What? Sergeant Muldoon sent you. Woo, I need all the help I can get. Woo! What do you need help with? This street is ablaze, wizard, and not in the way it's always ablaze. It's been completely consumed by anger and hostility and violence. Ablaze? What's he talking about? He Private Quinn's a stoner. You heard it here first, children. The fire elves have Imagine. gone insane. A gaggle of them even broke down the gate to the dark cave. Now the undead have spilled out into the street. I can't hold all these roving mobs of mayhem at bay alone. Please, wizard, can you drive the haunted minions back? I can try, but you don't really seem like you're really putting that much of an effort. Defeat haunted minion in Firecat Alley. All right, that's what we're doing. Let's check our check our deck real quick because like I I don't need shields. I'll keep one pixie, I guess, but this should really be doing it. We're going to have to get a pet with an AoE hit coming up pretty soon once we start having to defeat two people at once all right scarab which yay pet making you guys know i love pet making it always goes so well because <laughs> like our little this little guy our little pet now he's not gonna he's not gonna carry us i'm sorry would you guys be interested in that video or do you want me to do that like not on camera. Are you guys interested in pet making? I personally do enjoy watching it. I just don't enjoy doing it. But let me know and I will do whatever you guys want, I guess. I can show you guys my storm pet, that challenge. That would be a fun video. I need to start hatching with people who have a frillosaur to get that full damage frillosaur. And then Isabella's storm stats would be popping let me tell you she's pretty good she just has a a dog shit pet sorry all right let's hit with a fire cat since we are on fire cat alley it only seems only seems right dark sprite thank you very much Poor Isabella Balance, man. She's got it tough out here. 
All right, let's Thunder Snake. That should do a lot of damage, hopefully. Enough to kill him, at least. 127. You're dead. Bye-bye. Truce. We'll keep to this corner of the street. But we're not going back in the dark cave. It's spooky in there. This is new. This is all new, right? I've never heard this before. This is sick. I like that. Private Quinn. The undead have promised not to venture any farther. It's not ideal, but after everything else that's happened here, I call that a win. Yeah, you call that a it win? It all started when the Fire Elves were rehearsing the song Recollection from Fire Cats, the musical. Everything Never was heard going it. fine, pitchy soprano solo aside, when one of the Fire Elves suddenly shot a tiny arrow at me. Then another elf joined in. Oh no, he was like Shrek. Remember when Shrek like gets an arrow stuck in his ass? That's what happened. Then another. The animosity <laughs> spread like wildfire. Now even the lawn decorations have risen up and gone all stabby. Like wildfire, I like that. A named Lizzo Firespitter was coaching the elves on singing before the trouble started. I saw them attack her. I wanted to help, but... Uh, but... Uh, 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 I simply had to secure this position. Now I'm the only thing standing between all this chaos and Old Town. Please, will you check on Lizzo? Oh, Lizzo! Yes, we gotta go Lizzo, meet. Fire uh, uh, still caught I'm up talking. In the chaos of Fire Cat Alley. Please, Wizard, you have to find her. I'm speaking. Thank you, Private Quinn. Whatever your name is. Um, we gotta go see Lizzo, dude. This is Pog. <laughs> I know that there were some um. There's some drama with Lizzo being added into the game. I don't know what the hell's going on there, but I think this is so cool, man. Look at her. I love Lizzo, man. That's so cool she's in this. I don't actually think that this has any affiliation with her though. So I'm not gonna like DM her, D oh, DM her on Twitter and be like, yo, uh, you in Wiz? Imagine, let's this see. This is no place for a newbie like you. Wait. You're the new kid who cleaned up Unicorn Way, aren't you? <laughs> well, I'm glad you're here now. Aww. Some fire elves attacked me and stole my spell book. The truth hurts, but I'm literally powerless without it. Aw, uh, that's, that's a reference to one of her songs. I like that. Could you get my spell book back? You will? Thanks. Just try to be gentle, okay? The fire elves aren't evil. Someone, something, has corrupted them. Oh no. Corrupted fire elves? Let's go see. Dude, my headphones sound so staticky. I don't know if it's coming through in the video. If it is, I'm I'm sorry. I I don't know what you, I don't know what to do. I don't know how to fix that, but I think it's gonna be time for a new headset. And dude, Razer just came out with like wireless. Like they're pink, but they're wireless. And I think honestly we might be hopping on that, so. I'm excited. I I mean, this headset isn't like bad or anything. It's just like, I don't know why I can hear static in Wizard 101. And like everything's plugged in correctly. Whatever. Is he dead? Okay, cool. I like getting new things for my setup, man. It's always an exciting day. Like when I got my mic, this mic was like the biggest purchase I'm gonna make. Well, I, I don't know. That might be that might be a bit of a lie. I really want to get a new monitor as well. But I mean, these are all this is all like in the future um, because my monitor is um, dog water. Like it's so bad. It's not even 60 hertz. I got this monitor in like 2011. It was the old Alienware monitors. They don't even make them anymore. So that's that's really nice. So we need to be upgrading that. And fizzle. Yes. Fizzle. All right, Scorpion, I want to see it. I want to see you take him out. 
Look at the game trying to load. It's really struggling. Fire for Fido! Burnt out ends of smoky days! The stale cold smell of morning! Fire for Fido! <laughs> um, your voice does not match what you look like at all. But I appreciate the effort. Lizzo, I have info. <laughs> My spell book! Thank you! You really are as talented as they say. However, we're gonna need more than talent to help the Fire Elves. I have no idea what's causing my little friends to go cuckoo bananas like this, or how to help them. But I might know of someone who does. Cuckoo bananas? There's a rumor of a witch who was fired from Ravenwood that lives in hiding here on Firecat Alley. They say she turned a kid into a humongo frog. Oh, I think rude. we can convince her to use her advanced magical prowess to help the fire elves. I might be too optimistic, but that's a human in me. <laughs> oh, the wizard Creepy. in me is worried she's the one who caused all this. Either way, we need to find her. Perhaps one of the other denizens knows how. I saw Shellis Gruffheart cowering in a corner at the top of the hill instead of helping me while I was running for my life earlier. Uh, Why what are a, men great until they have bitch. to be great? Am I right? <laughs> oh well, go ask Shellis if he knows where the witch lives. All right, Shellis. I've never talked to Shellis before. Dude, also, did you see what wand she has? She has the, 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 the flute, the fire flute wand. Well, I'm glad I could think of that word like off the top of my uh, head like that. Flute? I probably would have been stuck on that one for a minute. <laughs> Leave me alone! Oh, you're a wizard. Wait, you're not two fire elves in a wizard costume, are you? No? You promise? Because I know I smash it. Yeah, let me just strip down for you real quick. Okay. Let's, like, I believe you. No. <laughs> Which is good. Yeah, I know. You don't want to see that. Lick of ice magic. So, are you here to save me, magical child? Oh, I'm Not also quite. a child. That's right. Fair enough. Inappropriate. What do you want then? Do I know where the old witch is? Hmm. I'm not sure. What I am sure of is that the bedeviled fire elves stole my strong box. My entire month's earnings are in that box, wizard. You get my strong box back. Wink, wink. And maybe I'll remember the answer to your question. Ooh, I don't like how he said that. Let us go on to defeat Fire Elf Pathfinders. Are it these guys? It do be these guys. Okay, cool. Zero of two. Let's hope we can do this fairly quickly. Let's use, actually, let's just like pass this round. I know that might be like controversial, but like I want to use my scarab. He should be able to kill him. Actually, no, I don't think he will. He only does 200 damage and that's like if it hits max. Dude, there's a hair. There's like a Luna hair. There's a dog hair. That's like in my chapstick. And I just like don't appreciate that, Luna. She's a hairy lady, let me tell you. He has a hundred health left. Gosh darn it. I need you to die. You're still alive, you're still alive, you're still alive. I love being a balance wizard. Do we have a blade? We didn't get a balance blade. Remember last episode, I was trying to learn myth spells? <laughs> It'd be rough out here. God, imagine if I actually did that. That would be so funny. I just forgot. Well, when I was actually trying to like record this, I got on my fire wizard by accident and I was like wondering why he wasn't giving me a quest, like the quest of Firecat Alley. I'm like, I know this is what I have to do next. Like I have documented proof. It's because I'm on my fire wizard. It's because the balance and fire colors are, um, they're both red, just different shades of it. I need this health. I know, I'm sorry, I'm running around here like a chicken. There we go. 
But no, we definitely don't have a blade. No, we just have a shield. So that's not too great. Oh, Isabella. I don't like it when you do that. Let's use our scorpion. Let's see if it can hit max. That would be really nice if it would get him down, like, as far as possible. It did not. Great. Damn, he has some white teeth. Imagine if that's what, like, your smile looked like. You're just that happy all the time. Fun fact. <laughs> I guess it's not really a fun fact. I'm just going to tell you guys about my life at this point, honestly. One of my teeth, I don't know which one it is. My front teeth, one of them's dead. So that's why it looks kind of like messed up. It's because it is. It's dead. It's dying. And I guess I'm going to insert a uh, trigger warning. If you don't like graphic, gruesome, gross stories, just like skip like 30, 30 seconds, 30 minutes. Um, but how that happened was, I was in like first grade. It was Halloween. Fire for fiddle. Oh, hold on. As he loves to tell. Fire for fiddle, the fiend of the fell. Fire for fiddle, fire for fiddle. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, it was Halloween at night, and I was like at school after hours because like my mom was helping the other moms set up for the elementary school <laughs> halloween party and i was in the cafeteria with one of my friends and we were jumping from like cafeteria table to cafeteria table don't ask me why we were kids and i slipped and i fell and i um split my lip open it like knocked all my baby teeth out which thankfully they were still baby teeth but that my front tooth was in my adult tooth is that what it's called was i'm um, growing in at that time so that's why it's dead and it's never gonna be able to go back to normal sadly oh we'll fix it someday i'll figure it out i'm playing whiz right now my strong <laughs> box thank you now about your question i can't say for certain she's a witch but there's a peculiar hermit who lives down the way she keeps her windows drawn and there's often strange smoke billowing from her chimney. That's the best I can get. Stoners. It. Hope it helps. See, I already said this before. I'm going to say it again. Stoners. Hermit's house. Let's see if we can see the smoke. <laughs> yeah, we can. It's that house, isn't it? The one where that's the smoke up there, that purple stuff. Don't get pulled. Don't get pulled. Thank you. Um, never mind. Never mind. That's some, like, magic smoke. <laughs> Magical. What? How dare you interrupt an old woman from her stories? Did Ambrose send you to banish me? Well, I'm not going without a fight. Imagine just breaking into someone's home. Not even like knocking. You just show up. What's that? Hello. Corrupted fire elves. Child here. magma men. The undead have spilled from dark cave. They need the witch's help. Was this foreshadowing to Caramel? Hmm. First off, no. I'm 100% not that witch. Or any witch, for that matter. I'm an alchemist. Secondly, this sounds like a city guard job. Yep, well, I'm a child, so I do all their dirty work. The guard is pinned down. Ugh, typical. All right, typical. then, I'll help. But I need to know exactly what we're dealing with here. Take this special vial and collect a sample of magma from those magma men you mentioned for me to analyze. We'll go from there. Ew, we have to get samples? I don't like how that sounds. You know what samples entail? Yeah, doing some, some stuff I don't want to do. All right. Magma men. Oh, magma man. One singular man. Ooh, let's see, what should we hit with? A dark sprite? I'm just having fun at this point. You will learn very quickly that I'm I'm not actually good at this game. I don't actually know what I'm doing. You would think, right? Cause like I've played it for so long. Um, no, no, that's not me. And damn, it gets so hot in here with this ring light on. But you know, it helps just like even out the lighting because if I didn't have it on, like it would look strange in here because 
There's a bunch of windows that are open on that side, and then this side is just nothing, so. I'd only be half lit up. I remember when I first got this ring light. I thought, like, a ring light was, like, such a good purchase. And I mean, it is. I still really do enjoy it. But I would record my videos at night because that's just what my schedule was. Um, it was always, like, 1 a.m. recording. And it would give me the worst migraines possible because it's, I'm in a dark room. My only light source was my monitors in this ring light that's just, like, blaring into my eyeballs. Oh, was not was not a fun time dude. I hate migraines if you guys suffer from migraines I feel sorry for you and I do feel your pain all right well I can't find any more health so we're just gonna have to go in not fully healed up but that's fine do -do 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 -do. <laughs> gotta love the music in this game I really wish like Lizzo would like drop some bars but I understand why we we can't do that. We can't just have her sing. And it's also not in affiliation with Lizzo. That's also, that's something I keep forgetting. It's not actually her. So that would, that would uh, not be good for um, King's Isle. <laughs> Dude, I was talking to my, one of my friends today about Wiz. Kyle, if you're watching this, what's good? Um. And he told me that Nick Jonas made like all the music in Winter Tusk. I thought that it was just like a one one and done thing, but he made all the music. Nick Jonas, that's crazy. You learn something new every day, I guess. Greta. Oh, that was quick. Ew, you smell like sulfur. Now hand me the magma and I'll run a quick analysis on it. Done. That was quick. Ah, looks like the root cause was a banshee's whale curse. Oh, and I recognize these melodic signatures. Bastilla Gravewind. Bastilla was the prima donna of the Fire Globe Theater decades ago. She had a bitter relationship with the Fire Elves, especially fellow actors. During a performance of Magic Fire Music, her elf co-star accidentally summoned actual fire magic, and that was the end of poor Bastilla. Ooh, that's kind of rough. I'd heard that she had a thriving underworld oh, theater never mind. career, but apparently she's decided to return with a vengeance. A Vanshee's whale curse works like an auditory virus. Rehearsals for that dreadful musical served as the perfect way to infect the masses. Thankfully, this particular whale seems to have no effect on humans, but we need to help the Fire Elves before their little brains melt. To reverse the curse, I'll need a Herkimer stone to record Bastilla's voice onto. Get one from the Rotting Fodder in Dark Cave. Oh, here I go to the Dark Cave. Oh, man. It's really all the way. It's so far away. It's just like, it's so far away. I'm hoping that we can use one of these teleporters up here. If not, I'm gonna be kind of salty. Kind of salty. Dark cave, right? It, is it, is it here? That didn't really help out too much. So um, it's not gonna be that one. That, that took us even, stop, stop. Just stop. What about the theater? Is it close here? Oh, man, really? All right, fine. Oh, wait, we gotta go this way. Sorry, my, um, my quest helper is not really helping me too much. It's actually making my life more difficult. Do you guys ever just like log on to Wiz and the little arrow just like doesn't work? It just like stops spinning. It's just like, nah, too much work today. That's always fun to deal with. Ooh, it's spooky in here. I don't like it. Rotting fodders. Rotting fodders. Rotting fodders. Oh, these are rotting fodders. Okay, cool. Wow, it looks just like Firecat Alley, but spooky. What boosts on Storm? Myth? Myth and Storm? That sounds right to me. 
I am correct. It still did absolutely nothing. Cool. Cool. 50. You think we can do 50? Let's hope. Fine. 81. He's dead. Bye-bye. Toodles. Ooh. Ah. Take our Herkimer stone. We'll dig up another to record our sickened beats upon. Yeah. Drop in bars, I see. I need someone to, like, actually release a Wizard 101, like, um, song. That it's actually, like, like a bot, you know? Like, take the Wizard City Trap remix, and if you know what I'm talking about, trust me, you know. If not, just, like, go to SoundCloud and type it in, um, Wizard 101 Trap remix. It's the comments. It's like, dee 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 and then it's just like a bot cool <laughs> and someone needs to like rap to that i would love that that would be the content i signed up for should i do that no i'm not gonna do that i thought about it it's not gonna happen no way no way the day that you guys see me sing is the day that someone needs to like call for professional help you know Ah, good. This Herkimer stone should work nicely to record Bastilla's wail. I'll override whatever noise the rotting fodder had imbued it with. You'll just need to get Bastilla mad enough to let out a good shriek. Herkimer stones naturally capture the sound waves of the undead. I did a little reconnaissance while you were gone. Big surprise, Bastilla is in her old house, the Diva's Tower, down the street. Good luck. Thanks. I'm gonna go make her scream. <laughs> I love this. All right. Do we have to go back into that dark cave? Is that something that we have to do? Should I have left like a port there? I don't know. I don't think so. I think that we're actually questing our way through Firecat Alley. I remember when they redid what was it? The storm one. Triton? Triton? Whatever the Triton one is? God damn, I really can't remember what it is right now. You think I can team up questing? You think someone would come and help me? It'd be really nice if someone did. I doubt it, though. We're gonna have to do this all by our lonesome. Oh, this is also like test room. Yeah, never mind. We're not going to team up. This is test realm. It is really fun that I have to do this all over again once it comes to live realm, but I'll skip that for you guys. And I also just completely dismiss everything that she had to say. So sorry, guys. It's habit. I really don't have a blade. I have that, I guess. But... That doesn't really help me too much. Oh, man. Okay. Let's just... I'm I'm scared for Isabella here. Oh, wait. Let's bring in these just in case something spooky happens and we die. Since we can't get anyone to team up with us. It's fine. It's perfectly fine. Let's try to get this minion out of the way as fast as we can I'm hoping I'm praying and then all we have to deal with is her I need to keep my heels too wow we're so squishy at this level I think it's so funny ew Don't die, Isabella. Please don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die. How much do I have to do to him? Okay, so a scarab should definitely kill him. See? Alright, you're dead. Bye-bye. Now I get to take her on. Which, I don't know if that's good or bad. She just scared me, too. Alright, what can we get rid of? I can get rid of that. I can draw. I can enchant my scorpion. Um, 
There's, there's just, there, there's no point in me doing anything. I just need to wait until I can hit. You're just gonna hit me every round, aren't you? Um, I guess I'm just gonna shield. Cause I don't believe in my, uh, my power. We're not that strong. I don't even know what level we are. We're probably like level like seven, eight. I don't know. I really, I could not tell you. All right, let's hit her with Scorpion now. This should do a good amount of damage. Maybe we'll crit. <laughs> Imagine we crit. 277. That was good. I would say that was not bad. Oh, look, our shield. It's going to help us here. 47. All right, how much health? She has 163 left, so I'm gonna hit her with a scarab. We definitely should not die. Now, the boss at the end of this? I, um, I'm worried for us there, 100%. I don't even know, like, what we're gonna do. We're really struggling with her. Like, we're almost dead. So, uh, what's his name? Like, Alec? Alec Kane? Alice? Alice Stair? I don't know. <laughs> I know it starts with an A. We'll figure it out when we get to it, because it's going to be coming up soon. How dare you upstage my comeback performance? It was going so well, too. I laughed. <laughs> I cried. Oh. It was better than fire cats. You look at her tooth. Enjoy this day, whelp. <laughs> we're just dancing. We're like, we you don't care what you're saying sorry. at all. This entire wretched city will be sorry! I think that Wizard City's fine, ma'am. All right, we don't need you. Dramatic. Dramatic. Now we gotta go all the way. Ooh, wait, there's a mandrake over here. You know, we gotta get all those for when we have to... I don't know, craft some spells in the future. What do balances even need to craft? Lore Master? I know Lore Master is a big one. That do be a big spell. Uh, um, like I said, I'm dumb. I don't know. Don't ask me. I'm asking you. <laughs> oh, man. Man, oh, man. Greta, I got a scream for you. I'm like Monster Zinc. I'm like Sully and Mike Wazowski. You know how they have to like make kids like cry? That's what Did I am. Did you capture Bastilla's whale? Great. What's that? She warned there's still more to Malister's sinister plan. Wait, Malister's behind this? Malister? Drake? The Death Professor? I'd heard he blew himself up with the death school after his sweet wife, Sylvia, passed. Oh, she sounds like she's into him. She's like, Malister? <laughs> the death professor? Truth be told, I'm not surprised. There was always a certain darkness about him. Sylvia was too good for that entire Drake family, if you ask me. Nonetheless, we still need to transmute Bastilla's whale into a cure for the Fire Elves. We'll just need a few things before we can get started. More things? the alchemical transmutation will require some equipment that I'm no longer privy to. One student turns himself into a humongo frog, and everyone wants the alchemy professor run out of town. Bartleby forbid Ambrose have my back. Anyhow, I can make do with crafting equipment. Here's a list of items to borrow from Gloria Crendel in Old Town. Just, uh, don't mention my name. We really have to go to Old Town? Can I just go to the commons? Is that quicker? I don't know what's quicker, actually. I think this was the quicker way. And we can regain our health too without having to drink a potion or get wisps. We're gonna need mana though because we did just have to leave a marker. Come here, mana. All right, so we have to talk to Gloria and not mention the witch's name. Gloria, I have a witch for you. 
Hello, young wizard. Hello. How can I help you craft today? You'd like to borrow some crafting items. Oh, I suppose that's all right. Let's see your list. Hmm. One large beaker, one crucible, five aludels, and a small athanor. Well, this is your lucky day. I just received a crate Ew, of those she's items. sideways. Of course, there are a few other items in the crate as well. Tell Greta she's welcome to them too. Call it an overdue parting gift. But I can spot Greta's alchemy setup a mile away. She, Don't she found worry. us out. Everybody knows she's been hiding on Firecat Alley. Oh, do say hello for me. <laughs> Yo, bro, why are your hands so big? Look at how big her ah, hands are. You must be the new student. I want to. F um. Finally, no. I'll need good leather. The belts the Cyclopes wear will be perfect. You can get some in Cyclops Alley. Go forth, young wizard. Hold how on, I'm not go? doing that. You go I'm doing this. In the list and Gloria says hello. Oh, let's just get this done. Go set up the alchemy table over there. All right. Oh, I'm setting it up. Wow, Ooh, this is cute. Equipment is nice enough for an amateur like you to perform the transmutation. Excuse Go me. On. Just place the Herkimer stone on the crucible. I do be plopping it down. There we there are. There it is. Now bring me the potion and let me check your work. Okay. Here's the potion. Oh, I can't walk. Here's the potion. Wow. A plus work. Wow. Here, young one. Good work. Now for the next part of the plan. The curative intonation potion. Oh my god. Similarly to the initial curse. So you'll need to administer it to an influential fire elf. Alicane Swift. Alicane, that's his name. Is the most famous fire elf actor alive. Once he's cured, just explain to him that it's up to him to pass the cure on to his people. You'll find Alacane in the Fire Globe Theater. Okay. I've imbued your wand with the curative potion. Now go give Alacane a good thwacking. What, what, what you be doing with my wand? Oh, accuracy. Wait. I'm using the wrong wand. Oh. Damn, I'm making a fool out of myself. Is there anything here that, like, can help us? Because, like, there's no, there's no... There's no way. No way. Can I go get, like, enchants before we go and we do this fight? Let's get to the Fire Globe Theater, and I will go figure it out. I won't make you guys come with me. This video is long enough. I just want to get it done, you know? I just want to beat Firecat Alley. I'll see if anyone will team up with me, though. I doubt it, but, like, why not? We can, we can see. Let's see. I don't think so. Alrighty, guys. I will be right back. Let me, like, get some blades or enchants or whatever for this fight. And I will see you in a second. Yo, I'm back. It was, like, a second for you. It was, like, ten minutes for me. Yo, Testron really be out here putting level caps on spells. And, like... I know why they do it, but like, that's just like rude and inconsiderate. So this is the deck that we're kind of working with. I have a storm shark because we're also a storm wizard, apparently. All right, we're going to mantle him. We're going to blade and then we're just going to pow. You know what I mean? You do. You know exactly what I mean. Fire for Frittle, the greatest magicians have something to learn. Fire for Frittle, wizard city must burn. Fire for Frittle. <laughs> Damn, you creepy. Uh, is this enough? I'm just gonna assume this is enough if we fail miserably. Uh, I'd laugh. I'd laugh so hard at us. Um, Yo, you wanna know who's like a crazy breed of people? And I only mention this because like I am actually genuinely curious. But um, the people that do whiz in hard mode. So like if you die, you have to like delete your wizard. But, like, that is... Uh, that... I don't think I could do that, to be honest. If I work, like, hard on a wizard and then she dies to some, like, stupid stuff, like, I don't want to... It's just really sad, you know? Alright, so let's just scorpion... 
this guy, I guess. See how much damage we can do here. We have our correct wand, so we have a little bit more damage. Not too much, but... 218. Not enough to kill him! Not enough! Also, I, uh, I think I exaggerated this fight's difficulty a little bit, because this... This is not too hard. I mean, we're balanced. Everything's gonna be hard, but I mean, it, 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 it's not terrible. Like, I can want it, this guy, and he's dead. Which is exactly what I'm gonna do, because I don't want to have to deal with him hitting me. And I can save up my pips. Oh, dead. Bye-bye. Tools. Don't kill me. Oh, you hitting with, like, weird things now. I guess let me... I'm just gonna shield again. I need pips. There's nothing I can do. I'm gonna try and blade next round. He's not gonna, like, weakness me or anything, so... I'm gonna blade. And then hopefully... Be able to do some damage. He has 480. Let me get rid of one wanted. I pulled a mantle. That's not what I wanted. It's not what I wanted, like, at all. I'll get rid of a scarab. There's my blade. I was really debating mantling him there. But I think that's a little bit, like, overpowered. Stop hitting me with life spells. I'm not equipped for this. I'm almost dead. You're stressing me out, sir. I guess we're just gonna, we're gonna scorpion, and then if this fails miserably, we're just gonna pixie. We'll heal ourselves. But hopefully this can do a good amount. 258. Oh yeah, hit me with an ice. I thought he was gonna hit me with ice. This is sad. All right, well, what what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? I guess let's just draw another blade and hit him next round. Maybe let's just hope that he hits with, like, storm or ice. He's not going to. He's going to hit with fire, but he's dead next turn. That's all I know. Ugh, so am I. All right, this has to kill Isabella. So, I hope that you are, um, well-equipped for this. Please be dead. Please be dead. Oh, Lo, thank the God. the resonance hath been driven from my brain. By the hand of this gentle wizard, I am again stark raving sane. How can I ever repay you? Give me some crowns. Oh, what's up, dude? You say only I can deliver my people from the grip of this dreadful Banshee's curse? But how? I am an actor. We are the opposite of people. The cure and my voice hath entwined? Then accept the role of hero I must. And I shall deliver a performance for the ages to the streets. This guy's scaring me. I just, I can't. I can't. Those fire elves, like, they really did something. <laughs> with how they look. It's definitely an interesting look, you know? Are we, we're still going, huh? Firecat Alley is not done yet. All right. I did not get that health orb because like, why would I? Why would it actually go into my body? There we go. Greta, I think I did what you told me to. I'm not gonna lie. I have short term memory loss. I forgot already. Well, did you fix this mess? Can I go back to my stories now? Finally, this whole ordeal has made me realize that I don't miss working with students as much as I'd previously thought. Oh. No offense. I don't like working with you. Run along then, dear. And if you would be so kind as to omit my name from your official reporting to the city guard, I'd appreciate it. Ta-ta. Ta-ta. Toodaloo. Oh, we leveled up. Poggers, we're level eight. Oh, dude, Isabella's really working her way through the spiral. I'm proud of her, man. She's doing so well. I never thought I would have a balance wizard, ever. Balance was always the school that I was like, why do people make balance wizards? Like, do you like torturing yourself? 
Um, and I guess here we are. But after I've played through Storm and Death now, Balance is just like a challenge. It's gonna be fun. So that's why I have Isabella Blade here. Great balls of fire, you're alive. When Don't I didn't hear back from you, I just dude. assumed. Well, I'm glad you weren't fricasseed. Did you find Lizzo? I, I did. She's safe now? Woo. She's and a safe. cure for the Fire Elves madness is being administered as we speak? You're amazing. You should tell Sergeant Muldoon. And feel free to mention how I'm still bravely defending this position. If it comes up. <sighs> Thanks, wizard. I couldn't have done it without you. I definitely could have done it without you, but I do appreciate that. I'm gonna go talk to Sergeant Muldoon here. And that is where we're gonna leave it off for today. What are we doing next? What is it, Triton? Triton Avenue. That's what we're gonna be doing next. So I hope you guys are excited. I like this walkthrough. I'm having a lot of fun with it. I do have to finish Caramel, like ASAP, because like the Lemuria prequest is out now. And like, I can't do it because your girl hasn't finished Caramel. So we're gonna be pumping out some Caramel videos as well. If you guys have already done Caramel, I guess just like hang out with me. If you guys have, then I have not, then like it would be your first time seeing it. It's cool. Hello again, young wizard. Hello. Do the smell of brimstone and burnt hair spell word from Firecat Alley? Now that's just my perfume. You helped quell an undead insurrection and cured a fire elf curse. Impressive. We're not out of the woods yet, but we're making headway. Alrighty, guys. Well, we finished Firecat Alley. We met Lizzo. We did all the new things. That was the new Firecat Alley. What do you guys think? I liked it. I thought it was cute. Um, I don't think like it's much different. Obviously, it's it's Wizard City. What could they do to like really blow our pants off, you know? But I do appreciate what they did with Lizzo and and everything. So I am gonna have to give it a solid. Um, 8.5 out of 10. What are your guys' thoughts? <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Well, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy it, please make sure to leave a like and hit that subscribe button before you go. And as always, the links to everything, my Discord, my Twitter, my Instagram are down below. I'm going to be doing a Discord giveaway when we get to 100 members in my server. I'm probably going to be doing like a crowns giveaway or something like that. So, make sure to join if you have not already nudge nudge hint hint but yeah guys thank you so much for watching i love you guys so so much and i will see you in the next one bye